Greetings and welcome to the Astronomy Picture of the Day podcast. Today's picture for June 28th of 2024 is titled Comet 13P slash Olbers. So what do we see here? Well, here we do see an image of a comet known as Olbers. And this is a comet similar in some ways to Halley's Comet, but not nearly as bright. And in fact, it orbits the solar system about once every 68 years, just a few years less than the Halley's Comet. Now, this one is actually coming in and will reach its closest approach to uh, the sun in just a couple of days now. Now, it's not as bright and prominent as Halley's Comet can often get, so it's not a vi visible easily without some kind of aid. So you could use binoculars, you could would be able to see it. But you're not, it's not going to be a prominent comet with the naked eye looking out at the sky this time. So here we have an image taken just a couple of days ago using multiple images put together to bring out a lot of the detail within the comet. And we see a lot of the structures that we associate with the comet, including the head of the comet up towards the lower right hand side there, and then tails stretching back. Now around the head, we see a coma, which is slightly green, and that is often due to the emission of carbon atoms. So a comet is kind of a dirty snowball. It's very icy and also contains a sooty material, carbonaceous material. And when that is vaporized, when it comes near the sun, then it will actually be energized and glows. And just as we often see the red glow of hydrogen in gases and glows of the aurora in our atmosphere, well, here the carbon glows a distinct green color. Now as you look further back we can then see the tail stretching back and that is the ion tail pushed back by the solar wind and you can see how torn apart it is and scattered based on the material the sun's very act active nature pushing it back away from the comet itself. Now we also see harder to see is the uh, dust tail which is kind of fanned out and scattered around the comet. The dust tail is a little bit heavier particle so that ion tail is individual atoms, individual atoms, individual ions that are there. When you get a molecules or anything slightly heavier, then they lag behind in the orbit and they form a second tail. So comets will generally show two tails and they can vary in strength depending on the nature of the comet in each case. So here we can prominently see the ion tail. In this case, because of the positioning of us and the comet, the dust tail is very spread out and wide around the head of the comet. So if you have a pair of binoculars and look toward the constellation of the lynx, if this is something that is actually visible over the next few days. So that was our picture of the day for June 28th of 2024. It was titled Comet 13P slash Olbers. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.